Hello beautiful souls, thank you for watching this video. My name is Yogi Emmanuel. I am a spiritual teacher, master healer, and a conscious content creator. For today's video, I will be sharing my opinion and my what would be the perfect word to say, my wisdom on the 3D, 4D, and 5D consciousness. Basically, we are transcending as a beautiful soul that we are we are realizing more of our truth. So the 3D aspect of reality is pretty much the sleeping human who, are, who is not conscious of their power, their true spiritual nature, and mostly running on their ego. So the 3D represents the time and space on the planet Earth. It represents unawareness of the nature of our infinite self and also when we think of 3d it's more about like action-based manifestation like planning setting goals um and just like working hard to make things happen so that's all stemmed from the 3d mentality which is connected to our ego um so 3D is pretty much a very limited way of seeing the world. It's very black and white. It's very right or wrong. It's, it's always duality, right? So that's what 3D is. It's all about the materialistic nature of our existence. Um, the, you know, the walls around you, your physical body, your clothes, the way you rearrange your life, the way you plan your life, all of that is third dimension. And, and that comes with problems, stress because of our society. Um, it comes with confusion. If you're really tapped into it, um, it's pretty much the matrix of this reality. So that's what 3D is. Um, what else? So also like physical pain, um, suffering that's also coming from 3D mentality, um, lack, um, lack consciousness is also 3D because they're not aware of the infinite nature, the infinite abundance of our existence, right? So that's what 3D is. It's basically that mindset of not having enough, um, working hard to make things happen, money, all of that. Um, yeah, so that's 3D. And 4D, let's get into 4D. 4D is self-awareness. 4D is love, self-love. It's wisdom. It's our innate ability to heal and understanding that we are consciousness, that we are soul on human body. Um, it's the understanding that we are here to serve others and that it, it starts from within us, right? So feelings, um, positive um, ways of looking at the world, um, a sense of infinity, right? Um, practice. So having like a spiritual practice that you do every day brings you into that fourth dimensional reality. So right now, this message is is uplifting for you and if you surrender to that you are gonna land into 4d consciousness so the more you talk about um things that are not natural not 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 natural um when you talk about things that are beyond what society tells you to look at so it's like also taking care of yourself knowing how to create um, a positive environment for yourself, for your body, um, eating well, um, fasting, knowing things that are, are ways to really 
um, increase your well-being. That's also fourth dimensional, but doing it in the most natural way for you. And also understanding your power of manifestation. Um, that whatever you put out there is what you get. So all these teachings are fourth dimensional. When you practice them, when you engage with them, when you understand them, that's fourth dimension. Um, forgiveness is also part of 4D. Self-awareness, appreciation, and gratitude. So that's also fourth dimensional frequency. So instead of like, instead of um, complaining or saying that you're not enough or that you're not manifesting or feeling sorry for yourself and being negative, um, those are 3D stuff. But when you learn to flip that and become more grateful, um, become more appreciative of everything that you have, then you start to shift into fourth dimension, right? So 3D, 4D, we've covered. Yoga meditation is also part of fourth dimension because um, you're creating that habit of raising your vibration, right? So 5D, what 5D is? Full spiritual embodiment. So this is when you're so aware of your true nature as a spirit, as a soul, and you, you're, your every action has that in the consciousness. So you're not thinking about lack anymore. You're not fearful of death um, in any possible scenario, not just like physical death, but like death of um, an old energy, death of basically like going through new things is and embracing it and trusting that there's a bigger plan. That's fifth dimensional, that mindset, Christ consciousness, pure unconditional love and service to the whole world. That's 5D as well. Um, living the dream. So you're no, you're not longer, you're no longer trying to make things happen. You're just living, you're just being. So when you're being, that's fifth dimensional. You're so like present in everything that you're doing. You've consciously created your environment. You made things very beautiful, um, more in alignment with your true self. That's 5D as well having a timelessness. So you're not limited by time. You're more patient. Um, you understand that everything happens in divine timing. So that consciousness is also very 5D. When you fully surrendered and trust that everything is on its way to you and that you are not um, going out there to make things happen because everything is already coming to you and it has already manifested, right? So you're being more present within yourself. Having body, out of body experience is also fifth dimension. So when you're, have, when you're having vivid dreams and you can fly and you can like create your dream reality, that's also 5D. So when you're having that spiritual aha moment, those are glimpses of 5D. So when your third eye is activated, like when you're starting, when you see visions in your mind, you hear your spirits, um, when you're having that conversation with God, um, you're channeling consciousness, you're channeling wisdom from your higher self. That's also very 5D. Um, when you fully embody the godliness of your nature, when nothing is stopping you from manifesting your soul's mission, that's 5D when you're fully empowered and sovereign in your energy, that's 5D. When you're in full alignment to your future and you understand that everything is now present within you, that's 5D. So those are the different levels of consciousness when it comes to 3D, 4D, and 5D. So let me know what you guys think about this topic. Um, this is just something that I'm really resonating to share with everyone right now and let me know what you feel what you think about this and what is your idea of 3d 4d and 5d and how it can help us into really centering ourselves at this time on the planet so thank you for watching this video hope you guys enjoyed it have an awesome one namaste